G'day, it's Rob here again. Well, here's a quick video, it might help someone. Just a little modification I did to the Vivo diesel heater. I've got the uh, air intake um, canister thingy mounted directly at the back of the of the unit, so I don't have a mile of intake hose. And it's always made a bit of a droney noise, a bit annoying, and I've finally silenced it, and it was dead easy. I'll show you where it is and what I've done. Well, there it is, sticking out the back of the uh, heater unit, and it just sucks in the warm air from in the shed and reheats it again. So, yeah, I think it's a better idea than uh, bringing in the cold air from outside. But anyway, do whatever floats your boat. So yeah, so that little black bizzo there sticking out was the sort of filter thing that they give you, strainer, air strainer. <laughs> anyway, I've just put a tin can on the end of it. Uh, that's the bottom of a tin can, so it's just held on with one PK screw into the end of the black plastic filtery thing. And it's got a bit of foam inside of it not to fill the air but just to act as a sound deadener it works fantastic i'll show you the other side of it so there it is you can see what it's doing it's just a tin can shoved on the end the bottom of a tin can and some foam and the air i did think about having the foam to filter the air but i think it would be too restrictive so all it needs to do is just kill the sound i mean you could get it to clean the air as well i suppose but uh no, I didn't go to a lot of trouble. This is just quick and dirty and works fantastic. Cut the noise right down to almost nothing. You can see under the bottom how I've got the uh, the airline routed, just short, and the uh, yeah the black canister that comes with it just goes through, and I just sealed it on in the back with a bit of uh, black silastic. That way it can't. Uh, go anywhere it's not gonna, it's not going to fall off or anything so yeah works fantastic quick and dirty mod okay that's it for me i'll see you next time cheers